Hey guys, so in today's video, I'm going to be doing an unboxing on the fourth generation Apple TV. So I'm really excited to be doing this unboxings. I know I've been doing a lot of unboxings lately. It's just a hectic time right now, so I'm sorry if you're waiting for new editing content that will be coming very soon. For a long time now, my family and I have had the third generation Apple TV, and while it's working great, it lacks a few things such as Apple Music, that streaming, and just the other few apps and things that we mostly like to use on the Apple TV that is not available on the third generation. So we decided to upgrade from the third generation to the fourth generation just because it has more features and it is just more convenient for us as a family with the apps that is available on it. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this video and let's get into it. Okay, so this is the Apple TV box and it is very big and the first thing I notice about this Apple TV is that it is significantly thicker than our previous one. So first off we have the remote and it has a bunch of controls on it. It has a trackpad so you can use that to navigate throughout apps. You have a menu button, you have an Apple logo at the back, you have a screenplay button, you have voice dictation buttons, you also have volume controls, so that's really nice, we didn't have that on the previous one. And then you just have a play and pause button. Here is the Apple TV Generation 3's remote. As you can see, it is smaller, it has a way different design. This one is more metallic than the fourth generation, but it doesn't have as much controls. So you don't have the trackpad, you have the manual buttons for navigation. You're missing the voice dictation and the screenplay and the volume controls. So there are a bunch of things that this Apple TV remote has that the previous one didn't. So yeah, that is the remote for this Apple TV. Then next up we have the Apple TV itself. Like I said, it is very big. It is very heavy as well. This one has 64 gigabytes of storage. Here are some of the ports that are on this Apple TV. You can see that it has a lot of ports. So it has USB, it has HDMI, and here is the other one. So it's basically the same amount of ports. Um, not a big difference in ports here. So yeah, that is everything that we can see physically on this Apple TV. Okay, so moving on from that, we have the other things that are in the box. So you take away the bottom thing and then you'll see you have the cable that you use to charge the remote of the Apple TV. So here you'll see the Apple TV has a port at the bottom. So you just plug that in and then you can charge it as you want. And then you also just have some book booklets and things like that. And you also get some Apple stickers with your Apple TV. So yeah, that's also really nice. Here you can see it. So it was hard to see when I didn't put something behind it. So there you just can see the Apple stickers. And like I said, there are some other booklets and things that you also get in the box. Um, quick start guides, things like that. Usually the things you always get in Apple product unboxing. So yeah, that's just everything that is in here. There are a few of those papers in there but yeah that's not very interesting and then the last thing we have is the power cable so i had some trouble getting this thing out just because like i said we bought the second hand so the guy just put it in here um and it just fell apart so <laughs> that is everything that is in the box for this apple tv and let's move on to the outro Okay, so that was my unboxing on the fourth generation Apple TV. I really hope you guys did enjoy it. And if you did, please give this video a big thumbs up. It really does help. Comment down below letting me know any other video suggestions you have for me. And just any other questions you have for me. I would love to answer them. And if you can subscribe by clicking on the icon on the screen. Click on the playlist to see all of my other tech related videos. And click on the video to my previously uploaded video. Love you guys so much. Be weird and be proud of it. Bye.